So you are Spartan. Yes, I am. Who wears basketball shorts? Yes, I do. I don't get it. I don't get it. Who are you? Mikhail. What What does that even mean? What, what do you do Those here? Special projects for Jeremy. What in the world are special projects? Would we'll tell you, but would we'll have to kill you. <laughs> really? All right, everyone, settle down. We got a lot to get covered in this meeting. All right, so second annual meeting of how the heck we're gonna pull off camp rules this year. We got five we need to get done. I don't in particularly care how they get done, but Jeremy says all of you are supposed to be involved, so I expect. All your participation. All right, right off of the top, the respect rule. Who wants it? Oh, Mr. Chair, pick me. I can do it. I can do it. All right, Mr. Boss has the floor. Yes. How do you want to do it? All right. Here we go. Exterior. Forget it. We're just gonna go into it. That's a that's not a good bad. idea. Hold on to that one. Not bad. I am not weird. All right, next we have the schedule rule. Any takers for the schedule rule? Allow me to do this one. All right. Spartan Martin has the floor. Take us away. This is more of a specialty of mine. Count goers, tis I, Martin, here to deliver the second decree of Jeremy Purvis, which is keep the schedule. The staff have prepared many glorious events for you to obtain honor for your family and color group. But if you do not attend, someone else will steal that from you. Do not let them. For those who would hide in their rooms, cower in the bathrooms, to you I say, you are less than dirt. You are not even the worms in the dirt eating it. Or for those who would sneak off in the woods, maybe for some one-on-one -on -one conversations, Know that I saw Mr. Boss spread landmines across the entirety of the woods. I did do that. <laughs> and at the edge of camp itself, I stand God. So for those who would still test your mettle, prepare yourself. For I am waiting. All right. Uh, this is a touch more for foreboding than we uh, normally try and keep the camp rules, but uh, I I'm, I'm sure it's fine, you know, threats of combat and whatnot. Uh, geez. A lighter note, uh, the prank rule. Uh, who wants any takers on the prank rule? Left side of the table. Oh, gosh. Um, 
Go ahead, Nikal. Uh, just uh, tell us what you have. Duh. He's like this. Children of camp, this is rule third, is no pranks. This will not be tolerated at the camp. We will not give you warning. You do prank, we send you home in bag. Now you may say, Mikhail, it's just joke. No one actually gets hurt. We do not tolerate. Camp is about having fun. It's not fun if someone is pulling pranks on you. Also, why you ask so many questions? Are you cop? Are you wearing wire? Sergey, take him. Da, da, dude. Dargala Bamanushka. You may think he's funny. Duct tape friend to bed. He's not. You may think he's funny. Throw a firecracker in shower. Cause he's 4th of July happy fun time. He's not happy fun time. This is last kid. Thought was funny pull prank on Tony Robinson. We see who's laughing now. Gosh, absolutely not. Why in the world would you think we could... Uh, do you want me fired? That was amazing. Don't encourage him. We cannot hit children with baseball bats. Prank was stopped. Mikhail! I do not see problem. Please! It's no problem. Oh my gosh, what do I have to do? We're doing this prank good. Fun, what do you got? I got you, bro. Here we go. What's up, SSM? I'm Martin, and this is Camp Rules. Now, most of the time, the only thing they ever let me do is when I come out and make fun of your stupid rooms. But today, I get a much better task. I get to talk about my favorite of the Camp Rules. That would be have fun. For those of y'all who are a little bit insecure, you're not sure you can fully let go during the camp experience, you're like, Martin, I want to have fun, but I'm not sure how. Don't worry. We have some footage for you to just show you of someone having fun. Please cut to our file footage of Tony having fun at the last camp. Dad, like, oh, oh. like, like, you look his face. Oh, my God. And if that's not quite your speed, we have some footage of the sophomores having fun. Look at me, I'm all the way turned up. I, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Mind's blown. Up top. Cool. Thank you. That was a much better way to handle a rule. Wholesome and classic. And no one got hit with a bat. Psycho. All right, that only leaves one last rule. Uh, it's the girls and guys cabin rule, otherwise known as no, no purple. Any takers? Anyone at all? Maybe someone who hasn't gone? Are you really not gonna say anything the entire meeting? I'm not doing it this year. I'm just not. Uh, no, you listen. All y'all have at least moderately cool gimmicks. I have no idea where you came from, though. You never existed. You're weird. If you want someone to freaking dance while they're purple, get the David Gentiles banana to do it. I'm through. Hate this place. <laughs> Come back. He's such a drama queen. Why was man purple? All right, look. This rule's really not that complicated. Guy cabins are over here. Girl cabins are over here. They stay separate. Is nobody concerned that man was purple? Alright, that's not a hard rule to explain. Any takers? Anyone? Really? I won't even make you paint your body. I am not weird. You guys are weird. Fine, we'll think of another way. Girls stay in girl cabins. Guys stay in guy cabins. The end of story. Uh... Alright, that takes us to the end of the rules. Any closing remarks, comments, concerns? 
You are a concern. Put your hand down. Goodness gracious. You know what? That's it. It's your room. Throw up an intro and take us out of here. Yes, I realize an intro doesn't go at the end of a video. Just do it!